Hello everyone, those crazy sounds mean that today we are closing out Film February with Blade Runner. Let's zoom in here. I think we're playing Blade Runner, hold on. Yeah, we are. There we go. The Blade Runner Westwood Partnership presents... Boom. Yeah. A lot of people may never have heard of this game. This one probably slipped through the cracks. Let's get a little backstory before I give you a little backstory. Early in the 21st century, the Tyrell Corporation advanced robot evolution to the Nexus phase of being virtually identical to a human known as a replicant. The Nexus sick replicants were superior in strength and agility and at least equal in intelligence to the genetic engineers who created them. Replicants were used off-world as slave labor in the hazardous exploration and colonization of their planets. But after a bloody mutiny by Nexus 6 combat team in an off-world colony, replicants were declared illegal on Earth under penalty of death. Special police squads, Blade Runner units, had orders to shoot to kill upon detection any trespassing replicant. This was not called execution. It was called retirement. Hell yes. This is, believe it or not, four years from now. Crazy. This is what it's going to look like, people. If you live in L.A., get used to it. <laughs> Maybe get a condo not next to one of the exploding fiery condos. Or I mean, that's a selling point for you. I don't know. Yeah, depressing, depressing uh, look at the future here. Or idea of the future, I guess. They use a lot of the exact same uh, scenes, like visuals, from the film and music as well. I'm leaving now. Lucy, my sweet. I cleaned out the tiger cage and sorted all the meal bins. So, if it's alright, it's my turn to fix dinner. D uh, haven't you forgotten something, little one? Just one little thing. Mr. Renser, please. It's been a very long day. I don't want to. Now, Lucy, I thought we'd settled this last week. Don't let's forget who pays your salary. Mm. We're closed. Come back tomorrow. Wait, I haven't finished with you. I told you, we're closed. We're not here to buy, little man. We've come to sell. <laughs> you can't possibly have anything to interest me. These are extremely rare animals of the highest quality. <laughs> what a coincidence. So am I. <laughs> that is the price for humility. Oh, please, don't. And what else might we interest you in today, sir? Perhaps some virtue? Oh. Uh, not my animals, please. I'm begging you. He is not happy. But what of honor, little man? At what price? Honor. Oh, my God, no. That tiger is the rarest specimen ever seen. Tiger, tiger, burning bright. The forest of the night. CR 61661, report to precinct headquarters. Code 3, repeat code 3. Here we are. I was just finishing up my 12 out on patrol when I got the call. Welcome relief, considering that the most action I'd seen all night was a schizoid grandmother doing the shimmy in her underwear in the second sector. <laughs> Vangelis. Fantastic flippin' soundtrack to this game. I love it. VR61661, report to division headquarters. Code 3, repeat code 3. Last time I had a 3 was when some hooker vomited Thunderbird on Bryant's desk, <laughs> and yours truly led the cleanup crew. Year and a half on the job, it was still the dirtiest work I'd seen. Where's Captain Bryant? Took a sick day. Got himself a heinous case of Tomain poisoning. <laughs> he asked me personally to run the unit in his absence. Guza. Guza was one of the old time guys who took their knocks in the streets. He had a friendly way about him, but you didn't want to turn your back on him if you were less than a friend. <laughs> Hope you've been enjoying your leisure time, kid. 
Because it's time to take that thumb out of your ass. <laughs> Hallelujah. Don't get too excited. The other Blade Runners are all jammed up. Holden sucking dinner through a straw. Gaff's working the Tyrell break-in and Steele's working special undercover. Looks like you got this one by default. You really know how to make a girl feel wanted. Animal murder done at Runciter Zoological. Probably just be a schizoid glitz, but we got the call. Old man Runciter lost something like a billion chinions worth. Chinion. Ten to one, this ain't a job for rep detect. You got something better to do? Perfect your French cooking, maybe? <laughs> Lemon tonight, Slim. I thought you were on special assignment. Steel. Wasn't too damn special after I had the suckers out. What happened? A couple of fours were masquerading as fibroplast insulators down at Kaiser. I dressed up like a nurse. They never had a chance. <laughs> I'll bet. You put them on the machine? Hell no. There's a beautiful little thing in here called the magic, and it ain't ever been wrong. You develop it, you got a brilliant career ahead of you. I'm working on it. What Scooza got you doing tonight? A.M. at Runsitters. Animal murder. Oh, those skin jobs got no respect for anything that truly lives and breathes. And that goddamn Eldon Tyrell ought to be zipped into a body bag and flushed into deep space. Get rid of him, we'd be out of a job. <laughs> I think we're all overdue for a little off-world paid vacation. You can stop staring at my ass now. You got eyes in the back of your head? All you gotta do is ask, Slim. <laughs> All right, let's check out that AM, Animal Murder at Runsters. Animal sales was a profitable and prestigious business since most real animals had died out after the Terran War. There were plenty of electric ones, though, powered by rechargeable batteries. No self-respecting human would own one of those frauds. <laughs> All right, let's, uh, before we get into this, let's make some choices here. Let's save. Call him Ray, because I think that's his name in this game. We're not Deckard in this one. We're not Harrison Ford. We are Ray McCoy. And I'll hold up here. Okay. So, pull my piece out. That's what the right click does, apparently. So can I shoot people randomly? No. What? Oop. Did not mean to do that. <laughs> Let's stay here. McCoy's apartment. Police station. Runsters animals. We don't have a whole lot unlocked so far. <laughs> Hope no one noticed that. <laughs> don't mind me. All right, let's, uh, let's look for clues. This is a bit of a detective game. Adventure real times. It's like the first real time game ever made. That's how they. That's how they uh, advertise this. So. Find something. Ooh. Piece of chrome. From a car. No, I think it's horse chrome. <laughs> Bag it and tag it. Nah, I think I'm being a dick. What do you know? About 30 counts of animal murder and one of aggravated assault. <laughs> the shop's been thrashed. You ought to see this tiger cup they got in there. It's a goddamn tragedy. Oh. How's old man Runciter holding up? State of shock. He's been moaning and complaining about his world caving in. You'd feel the same way if they were your animals. How many perps? At least two. Bloody footprints all over the scene. Must be a delightful sight. See what else we can dig. Scratches out. and paint flecks, and I knew what they meant. Unless the city had bought a jet black fire truck, somebody had a big fat traffic ticket coming. <laughs> what else we got? We got in the dumpster here. Nothing even remotely interesting, but hell, if I was gonna root through trash, my expectations weren't too high. <laughs> Sierra taught me to always look in the garbage, so whatever. Did I see another blue? Is this for my car? It's for my car. Do you talk to everybody? Anybody see anything? Canvas the area. Maybe somebody had his eyes open. I'm on it. You shouldn't need me to tell you to do that, guy. Come on. No, it's horse chrome. This is how I look for clues, just as if I were a real detective. Just kind of hover your mouse over everything and tell you, uh... Run out of options. Well, I don't know. That might be all there is to see out here. Let's uh, let's try going inside. 
Judging from the distance between the prints, I was looking for two very big men. One dragged his right foot, indicating a possible injury or lameness. The other appeared a lot more controlled, graceful even. Quite a pair. Sup, old McCoy, man, LCD. I'm absolutely certain Lucy Devlin was involved in this heinous act. Didn't ask. She's the young girl who works for me. She's responsible for all this mayhem? No, of course not. It was two men acting in concert with her, obviously. 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 <laughs> What'd they look like? Big and scary and absolutely malevolent. Okay. Let's poke around here. Let's see if the security cam got You got anything. any discs from that camera? It's irrelevant. Those murderers also destroyed the camera. Thousands of chinyens worth. <laughs> Maybe it photographed them before they shot it out. Mm, I guess you've got a point, that. Just let me do my job, Runcitor. Don't give me sass. Chinyan is my favorite currency of any video game, I have to say. <laughs> I believe this is the disc from last night. Ah, uh, there's the Peachy. Use. Peachy. Alright. Anything else? Can you think of anything they might have been after? First, I thought they wanted money, but I don't keep any in the shop. I didn't know Then that. I thought they wanted to steal my animals, but they started executing them. Yeah. Could they have been replicants? Who else would be capable of such barbaric acts? Alright. Why don't you tell me how you really feel? That's... I guess I can't be too upset if My precious right. one. She was my baby. You ever do any business with the replicant manufacturers? Tyrell Corporation? I resent that accusation. <laughs> Just wondering. Officer, last May I personally sold Governor Kolvig an exquisite Berseron cult. I have been a guest at his house on three separate occasions. Do I look like I need to carry artificial product? Where'd you keep a cult in here? That's what I want to know. Tell me about this Lucy. Yeah. There's not a lot I can tell you. She's only worked for me for a short while. She's about 14 years old, with pink hair. 14. A very attractive young thing. How'd you find her? She came to me with a reference from Ogilvy's in the Northwest Zone. Uh, okay. And he's a very reputable wholesaler. You treat her well? As well as any young tot should be treated. Mm. She got a desk? <laughs> or some place where she worked? She used to eat over there. <laughs> See if you can dig up that reference from Ogilvy's. Yes, it's somewhere here. Just a moment. Hmm. I guess he's actually going to give me that. Here you are. Thanks. Stick around. I may not be finished with you. I have to pull my gun out to intimidate no one. Let's uh, check out the little eating area. As he said. What the hell? Hmm. A toy dog. With wheels for legs. What else we got? Uh, Howie Lee's in Chinatown. I'd eaten there myself. How do I know I wasn't connected to this? Monkeys! Well, isn't that cute? <laughs> isn't that cute? It's honest A candy response. Bar. Yuck. <laughs> really? Yeah, it's everything's weird in the future. Cheese is illegal. Animals seem to be universally endangered. All my animals. That's why they make fake ones. I tried to say fake ones and said fake ones. All right, I think we're good. I think I've seen enough. I'm ruined. It didn't add up. Animal murders, the lack of any theft, the small animals alone were worth a good chunk of change on the street. It seemed more like an act of vengeance. Dirty replicant scum. Oh, I forgot I can also change some of these. So we can designer cut. Do I want that in there? I guess I do. So we can be polite. We can be normal. We could be surly, which I kind of, I'm tempted to go with. Erratic. <laughs> Or user choice. Probably want user choice, right? I don't know. Let's try this for a while and see how it goes. Save going. All right. Find anything? Find anything else out here? This woman says she saw that kid who worked for Runciter hanging around with a big fat guy last week. 
canvas the area. Maybe yeah. somebody had his eyes open. Which woman? I'm on it. Canvas the area. Ugh. Maybe somebody had his eyes open. I'm on it. All right, so apparently they relay everything to you and you give it to me. Find anything else out here? This guy lives across the street. Says he heard a crash late last night. Looked out his window and saw a black sedan speeding away from the scene. Hmm. Canvas the area. Maybe somebody had his eyes open. I'm on it. Find anything else out here? Zilcho. Real actions inside. Abstract art. All over the walls and ceiling. I never did appreciate art. <laughs> Alright. That might be, uh... Am I missing anything else? Might be it for now. Interesting. Alright. Let's uh, head back to HQ. Access the crime lab thing. Or we can go to Chinatown and talk to Howie. Let's do that. I'm hungry. Can't be uh, solving crimes on an empty stomach. Yeah, a lot of the music, a lot of the uh, visuals, a lot of everything from this game. Even the, some of the original voice talent is straight out of the movie. So they, they got a lot of the original vo uh, actors to reprise their roles and do the voices. It's pretty cool. Let's talk to Howie. Beautiful night, isn't it? When business thriving, night always beautiful. Gotta like Howie. Ah, there we go. So what happens? See you later, Howie. What happens if I switch it over to normal? Uh, here's all my clues, my clue database. How Howie leaves in Chinatown. I'd eaten there, there myself. Different suspects. Lucy. No images yet. This is the suspect database. Crime scene database, this clue database, yeah. Sometimes you have to go over these again. That's interesting. Judging from the about 30 counts of animal murder. That's handy. Handy to have that on hand. A lot of hands. Alright. So it's if This from your place, isn't it? Uh -huh. Could be. Chop that come from Yoshi's restaurant supply. Interesting. I, I don't think I've ever tried setting it on. This guy looks like he's on drugs. McCoy, LPD. I don't like the way he's walking toward. Oh, okay, he's fine. Excuse me, pal. McCoy, LPD. No respect. You got anything that's a match for these? <laughs> oh, well. I need to ask you. Yep. McCoy, LPD. No respect for the police in the four years. What's from now. real fresh tonight? Special shipment of Toro just arrived. I fix you right up. No one else. <laughs> Clean as a whistle. You're a prince, Howie. <laughs> Try being an asshole. See how that goes. See you later, Howie. Oh. See you later, Howie. Fine. Hey, big guy. Busy. No time for talk. Mm. McCoy, Itazura Suruna. You want something, you talk to me. Sorry, Howie. Got to mix more out back. I'll have a private word with Mr. Giant Chef. <laughs> Need to work on my adjectives. What's going on, man? Howie says you're a master chef. You not come back here! Air bad! Air bad? This'll only take a minute. Yeah, I'm looking for a girl, about 14 years old with pink hair. You seen her? I don't know her! Whoa! Shit. I have to do a new slot. Hopefully it's not running away as we speak. Okay. What's going on down here? A big guy run past here? Hey, maybe spare some chinion? Sorry, pal. All I got are hundreds. Hey, <laughs> that'd work. I don't have time for you. I shot that guy once accidentally. I remember that. God, this game can be creepy. Because he's around here. If you wait too long, 
you'll miss him and you'll meet up with him later. Hence the uh, the real time. But if you get there quick enough, shit. Whoa. Okay. Get down. That was scary as hell. <laughs> Just kind of popped out of nowhere. Lightning Squad, Rep Unit, Battle of the Gemini. I'd retired a war hero, someone who'd fought for the freedom of the off-world colonists. I've gotten all I can from that. Rep sack of shit. I'm sorry, guys. I just when I'm dealing with reps, I get a little emotional. Locked. Yes, yeah, so I would have been trapped. Locked. Huh. I've gotten all I can from that. All right. Well, that was a little early excitement. And the cops showed up. A couple minutes late. Yo. Chill it, man. Just took a wrong turn back there, that's all. Uh, Take your business elsewhere. An excellent idea. <laughs> it's a crime scene guy. Is he wearing lipstick? Alright. Let's see who showed up. It's Gaff. Rumor has it you've been earning your stripes, McCoy. <laughs> Working on it. Keep it up. You just might have a future in this business. I understand it's got a hell of a retirement plan. I checked with you and <laughs> Air. Looks your rep swung that Moonbus massacre last month. Ah. They ever find the Moonbus? Disappeared into thin air. Brian thinks it crashed out in the Kipple. How many reps are we talking about? Enough. <laughs> They're Nexus Sixes. So don't take too much slack. Gotcha. You VK the mark before retirement? <laughs> Didn't have to. He came at me with it. That's why they call it the magic. <laughs> I'm starting to understand. You ever retire a human, your career is over. Yeah. Remember that. Yeah, that would have been bad if I had shot that random hobo. But yeah. I don't think they call it the magic when the guy comes at you with a giant chef freaking knife. Giant frickin' chef knife. That's what it. Hey, it's this guy. Excuse me. What's wrong with you? I need you? to ask you. McCoy, LPD. <laughs> I need to ask you. Excuse me, pal. I don't know. McCoy, LPD. <laughs> it's like carrying my gun around. Is the body still up here? I guess it was a butcher knife, is what it was. Wow, they cleaned that up fast. Alright. Cool. Retired my first rep. Let's, uh, let's see what Howie has to say, now that I've killed his prize chef. <laughs> he doesn't seem to be too concerned about it. How long has that chef worked for you? Zubin? Zubin? Just month. Superior chef makes all kinds of new suits. He just came off of the uh, the moon bus guy. See you later, Howie. The colonies. He was a Nexus Six, but I won't, I won't judge you too bad, Howie. Everybody's gotta make a buck. Does this badge mean anything to you? Damn right, McCoy. Excuse me. Excuse me, pal. <laughs> I'm gonna keep doing that till I get the response I want. All right. Anyway, well let's. Go back here again. Maybe that. Any clues in here? Man. I was. Maybe the sound just makes me hungry. It doesn't look very appetizing. Yeah, I forget if you don't jump out of the way, what happens? You just, just scald you. You just burn to death. Not literally burn, but you know. Let's check in here. This dumpster. Ah. Nothing even remotely interesting, but hell, if I was going to root what? through trash, my expectations weren't too high. What about the uh, license plate I just found? Let's take a look at that. Lightning Squad, Rep Unit, Battle of the Gemini. Zubin. License plate. Hmm. I'll have to put these in the uh, crime computer. 
Judging from the distance between the prints, I was looking for two very big men. One dragged his right foot, indicating a possible injury right. or lameness. The other appeared a lot more controlled, graceful even. He did look a pair. nothing like the guy just shot and killed. Yeah, want it for animal murder, so that's the guy. And the moon bus. And we just gotta find the well-dressed gentleman from the intro. And this game will be over, just like that. Alright, let's get out of here. Get out of Chinatown. Chi-town. Chi-town. Other variations. Alright, um... Let's go to HQ. I don't think I've earned a break yet. Have him go give me a congratulations back at the station. They'll probably throw me a retirement party. <laughs> Right now is my first uh, kill. Maybe it'll just sass me. Either way, I gotta use the computer. Ground floor. Ground floor. Mainframe and shooting with laboratory. Lock up. I don't think there's anyone lock up yet. Laboratory. Let's go to lab. See if they got any information or anything. Got anything new for me, Dino? I was wondering when you'd show your mug around here, McCoy. McCoy. We got the animal corpses from Runciter's, but there wasn't a whole lot to work with. Bone marrow? About 50% were real, the rest were fakes. Huh. So, Runciter was ripping his customers off. What a douche. State of the art fakes. <laughs> Miles beyond the crap you see on Animoid Row. Hmm. The kind that comes from legit manufacturers? Eh, they're the ones that usually produce the quality. <laughs> what about the wounds? Most of them were shot point blank, but we're looking at some others. <laughs> Sloppy cuts with a knife, like the perp was really pissed off at something. Butcher knife? Could be, but who cuts meat anymore? <laughs> nice bunch of reps I'm tailing. Hope you're not pulling a meat cleaver out of my back next week. <laughs> Anything else? I'm not done with you. That black paint you found on the fire hydrant? It's from a ground car. You sure? Who still drives the angle those? The impact was almost head on. In 2019. And there ain't too many spinning <laughs> drivers clutzy enough to smack a street level hydrant in VTOL mode. I heard your wife got her license back. <laughs> <laughs> You're a real funny guy, McCoy. Uh, anything else? That was pretty good. That piece of chrome you found outside of Runciter's is from a 1995 Pontiac. It wasn't horse chrome. Nice set of wheels. It's okay, not what I call a classic. Anything else? Zip man, try me later. Fair enough, Dino. It's always a cigarette butt in that little tray there. Let's go to the mainframe, see what we can learn. Violent street crime in the city rose again last year by a whopping 26%. Shooting According range. to the latest figures from the Department of Justice, Governor Kolvig attributed the change to the dramatic increase in the number of specials registered as city residents and promised a tough new set of standards for the City Immigration Bureau uh. by next month. Old copies of case files, notices, and memos. The usual station junk. Who was smoking here? Lucky Strikes. Crystal's brand. I knew she was spending a lot of time in the training maze these days, even though she'd already gotten close to a perfect score. Crystal Steel. Best gunner on the on the uh, the force. Forget how do, how do I how do I do the? I would like to do the training room. Well, if it ain't Ray McCoy. Hell yeah. Ryan finally letting you play with the big boys. <laughs> My clearance come through. You bet. You bring your piece. Don't leave home without it. <laughs> Steele's been running the maze every other day for two weeks, and the targets are getting a little roughed up. <laughs> I thought Guza was going to requisition some new ones. I ain't seen him down here in a month. Guess he's been busy. <laughs> Poor guy. I bet he gets all tuckered out from pushing those papers around. And don't sell him short, McCoy. <laughs> Guza could be one tough hombre. <laughs> I remember when we worked mice together. He poured acetone on two pimps that gave us some lip. <laughs> <laughs> and lit a match. <laughs> I'll tell you, it looked like the goddamn 4th, 4th of July, July out there. <laughs> Peachy. Uh, I still use that line. Not in, well, not, not when I'm burning pimps, mind you. You but. keeping busy, pal? Nah, the place has been pretty quiet the last couple of days. <laughs> you keeping busy, pal? No, no, it's not really. All right, 
I want to do it. Let me in. Actually, let me save first. Let me actually save. Boop. Hit the lock, Jack. I guess there ain't no harm in it. <laughs> he says that every time. Target and shoot all threats. Let's do it. Do not shoot innocents. Confirm target as hostile before shooting. Confirm. With like a, a VK test? How am I going to do that? Yeah, I could never get this thing to work. Target's never popped out at me. Oh! Is that, is that a bad one? I don't... Are these bad? Oh, okay, there we go. This has never happened before in my life. I've sat around, too, waiting for targets to pop out. This is pretty sweet. I don't know what the issue was after all these years. Alright, so I'm assuming it's... Is that a gun? I... Is that a gun? Saw that. I'm starting to think I killed a lot of innocent people just now. Innocent targets. This is fun. Just because I never was able to do this. Is that a gun? Ow. Who the hell? Are they actually firing rounds at me? No idea why it's suddenly working now. Maybe it's the installation configuration I have going this time. Maybe I was just too impatient in the past. That sucks. <laughs> Alright, so I guess I'm looking for that little blue thing, finally. That guy doesn't have anything. I think I should do this over now. Now that I know what to shoot or what to sort of look for. Hurry up. How'd I do? Negative 51. <laughs> Alright, I gotta do that one more time. Hit the lock, Jack. I guess there ain't no harm in it. <laughs> Let me shooting a bunch of innocent Target and shoot all mannequins. Threats. Do not shoot innocents. Uh. Confirm Man. target as hostile before shooting. I have a hankering for some Chinese food now. Howie got me all worked up. I guess I saw a gun. Yeah. What? Well, how, how do you tell which is which? Alright, obviously that was a gun, but... That was obviously a baby up there. This looks like he has a gun. But I don't, I don't know. Yeah. There's still something here. Ooh. That was 
Nice. That might qualify as sexy. Okay, I don't... Does this guy have anything? I can't... Okay. Whoa! Damn it! I'm a little concerned at what these things are flinging at me. Just go to the next screen. Is there a time limit? Bring him out. It's real rain, by the way. <laughs> Have the sprinklers turned on? Continuously. Boom. What do you got? Okay. Alright. Still, that one on the last screen just looked like a woman not holding anything. I took something to the face. Do you have something? I don't... Okay. Huh. Ah! Damn. Yeah, this is the screen I always wanted to see people pop out on. I guess I was just too impatient. I don't know. lucked out that they had a gun over there, because I don't... Alright, so that's a baby, obviously. Um, boom! Does this guy have a gun? I heard something. This has to be better run than last time. What is that? What does he got? I can't tell. I don't know if they have to be holding a baby to be considered harmless, innocent. Is that a baby? Ah, crud muffins. Alright, let's just get out of here. Die. This run wasn't much better than the last one. <laughs> Took more damage. I've killed someone who was clearly holding a bit. Well, not clearly, but... Alright. I'm just gonna put my gun away for you. Wave at you. Okay. Everybody's got a baby. Boom. Boom! Let's do it. Let's check it out. Alright, negative 21. Not too bad. Not too good either. What was Steel's score? 64. What's a perfect score then? If he said she's getting close. Alright, whatever. Um, we're coming up on 30 minutes where it's been probably a little over 30 minutes. So let's take a break and pick it up in part 2.